Welcome to Shuttleworth. My name is Georgia, I'm the Weddings and Event Manager here and today I'm going to be giving you a tour of the beautiful Shuttleworth House, Swiss Garden and Parkland. If you'd like to follow me, we'll now make our way through the double doors behind me to see inside. We are now in the front hall. This is the first room that your guests will see as they arrive to Shuttleworth House through the wooden doors in front of me. On your wedding day, you will have exclusive use of the entire ground floor, and that's where you can decide what you want to take place in each of the rooms to customise it for your special wedding day. Beside me here, we have the grand piano. This is one of the existing pianos of when the family lived here, and we're very lucky to still have it fully tuned and working, so if you wanted, someone could play as your guests arrive on the day. Welcome to the saloon. On your wedding day, you may decide to use this room for a wedding breakfast where we can see up to 80 guests, or alternatively, it is also licensed and you can have up to 110 for a ceremony. If you take a look up, you will see there are six smaller chandeliers that are all originals and two very large, stunning chandeliers here. The gold detailing throughout the ceiling is a stunning backdrop as your wedding breakfast. Welcome to the morning room. This is one of my favourite rooms on the ground floor of the house as it's such a light and bright open space. If you look through the windows, there's spectacular views across the parkland, giving your wedding photos a fantastic view on the day. This room is licensed for up to 70, so if you'd like, you could choose it to be the room for your wedding ceremony. Alternatively, you may choose to use the morning room for your wedding breakfast. Here we can see up to 60 guests. We are now in the drawing room. This room is predominantly used for the evening reception as the large bay window is the ideal location for your chosen band or DJ alongside the black gloss dance floor. Another option is that you could use the drawing room for your wedding breakfast. Here we can see up to 50 guests. For our larger wedding celebrations of above 80, we can open up the double doors from the morning room coming into the drawing room to create a large open space seating up to 110 guests. For our more intimate wedding celebrations, the dining room is a fabulous location as you can see up to 20 around the original wooden table here. Alternatively, in the evening we could open it up as a quieter snack to serve tea and coffee and your wedding cake as well. On the middle floor we have a variety of rooms where you can get ready on the day of your wedding to take away any stresses of travelling in dresses or suits as well. The staircase is also the most perfect location for capturing the first look photos prior to the ceremony or those couple photos during the day for the special moments. This is the billiard room. You may decide to have your wedding ceremony in here on your special day and we can see up to 80 guests. There's beautiful dual aspect views across the parkland with stunning windows either side. Another option available to you is we could use the billiard room for your wedding breakfast. Here we can see up to 70 guests. For our wedding celebrations above 150 guests, we can offer an area of our parkland where you can build and design your own marquee or teepee overlooking the spectacular Shuttleworth House. We are now at the Summer House. Set within the sunken lawn here is a very charming, idyllic outdoor wedding ceremony venue. Here we can see up to 20 inside and a further 80 on the lawn. Once your ceremony has taken place, we can then also serve drinks and canapes at the Summer House and your guests can enjoy the croquet lawn. Welcome to the Swiss Garden. Here we have a late Regency garden that has got nine acres and 13 listed structures. It is often described as a hidden gem in Bedfordshire. We also have two licensed venues here, the Swiss Cottage and the Grotto and Fernery. We are now at the Swiss Cottage. Here we can see up to 20 guests inside and have up to 50 standing on the lawn. For those looking for a more unique wedding venue, I would highly recommend the Grotto and Fernery. Here we can have up to 17 guests standing and it is absolutely amazing. If you look around you can see the polymite stonework, the variety of ferns and the stained glass doors as the guests arrive. During this time, while our team look after your guests to serve drinks and canapes, you can then make your way through the Swiss Gardens to capture your wedding photos. You can explore the secret pathways taking you through to the bridges, the ornate archways, seeing the beauty that the Swiss Garden has to offer. Thank you for joining me on our tour of Shuttleworth House, Swiss Garden and Parkland. For more information or to book a private viewing, please email weddings at shuttleworth.org.